Hey guys, okay, we're now to part two of our Mobula 7 Fly Sky Edition Basic Editions setup, and we're going to be doing the TX16S, which you're going to see right here on my screen here. So let me go ahead and open this up. All right, so here's what we've got. Now that we've got our, our, um, our um, quad set up, now we need to go ahead and set up our uh, radio, right? So let's go ahead and power up our radio. Welcome to now, I may make some mistakes here because I don't use the TX16S very often, but I'm going to try to remember this. This is the part where I get a little screwy. <coughs> All right. <coughs> First thing we want to do is you have your wheel right here. Go ahead and hold that down. And we're going to go to model select. Okay. And I'm just going to pick a model that I have on my radio. Um, so let's just say I've got a Flysky SQ130 that I used here. I'm just gonna, I always copy my models. So if I hold down the button, you can do create model, duplicate model. I guess we could create it. All right. So let's just click create. Um, I don't have an option here for a drone, so I'm just going to click plane, I guess. And do you have a, does your model have a motor? Yes. Uh, whatever. Uh, let me just, let me just get out of this. Okay. So here's our model. I just hit return so we could get out of it. So here's my model here. So now I'm going to highlight it and I'm going to click, uh, I'm going to click, whoops, no, we've already done this one. So let's just go ahead. Now that we've got this model, this is the one we selected. Sorry. We're going to hit return and get out of this. Hold your model button down right here. And then now you're going to see your model here. So let's go ahead and rename this model first. First thing we're going to do is we're going to call this a happy model. So bear with me as I try to type with my fat fingers this thing. Uh, H, A, you know what? Uh, yeah, well, I'm just going to do this. I'm committed now. I can't turn back. So H, A, P, P, uh, Y, and then put a space. Happy. And I'm just going to put a mod. Happy. Oh, my goodness. I hate this part. M sure not as much as y'all hate watching me do it mod uh let's put happy mod seven okay and then i'm gonna put uh whoops and then i'm just gonna put the letter f i don't know how many characters i have left but i'm hoping i can fit this okay and i'm just gonna put the fly Okay, I don't know how many more I get, but I'm just gonna leave it at that. So Happy Model 7 uh, Fly. Okay, that means it's a Happy Model 7 Fly Sky Edition, whatever. Now I'm gonna scroll backwards, okay? I'm gonna start spinning to my left, and I'm gonna go to my <laughs> internal RF. I'm gonna click it, and I'm gonna turn it on. I'm gonna select Multi, okay? And then I'm gonna select uh, Fly Sky here, all right? But I'm gonna click it, and I'm gonna scroll until I get to Fly Sky 2A. Okay, and if you keep scrolling, you can fly to it. Right. I'm going to go to Fly Sky 2A, hit enter. Then I'm going to scroll again and click over at PWM iBus. And I'm going to scroll to where I get PWM S bus. Okay, I'm going to hit enter. And then I'm going to go ahead. Now, I believe this is my fourth drone on my models. So I'm going to make my receiver number four. Now, I've already. Let me see. So let me do that. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to. Once I'm done with this, now I want to get ready to bind, right? So I'm going to go to bind here and I'm going to click it and you're going to hear it. Uh, you should hear it chirping. But first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to my beta flight and connect. Let me get my mouse to work here. My mouse is. Okay, let me go to connect. And I'm going to go to my CLI. Okay, and I'm going to come over here and I'm going to type the following command. I'm going to put uh, bind underscore RX. Whoops. Sorry, let me try this again. I have the keyboard set wrong. Bind underscore RX and hit enter. And then I'm gonna click bind right here. Okay, and right there, I just heard the beeps. I'm bound, everything looks good. And you can see that it's done here. So with that set, I'm gonna hit return, return. And you can now see that I have my signal here. Let me just show you this way. You can see now I have my RSSI signal right here. Okay, and uh, so we're bound. So in beta flight, let me go back to the screen here. I'm going to go ahead now and I'm going to type save and it's going to automatically restart and we are now back in and we are now bound. And if we go to, if we go to beta flight now and I click connect, what you're going to see now is if I go to my receiver tab, uh, you're going to see now I've got my, I've got to change my uh, channel order. So I'm going to go drop down here and I'm going to click this one here and click save. And as you can see now, I've got my throttle, I've got my roll and pitch going, everything's good. I don't believe I have any switches configured yet, so we're going to set that up next. But right now, we're bound, guys, so that's the best part, okay? So we're going to stop here. We'll stop here, 
and we will uh, come back with the next part, which is assigning switches, including our RSSI setup. Okay, guys, be right back.